Hey guys. Um, so I am all dolled up because I am gonna go to, I, I don't think I've ever said it, but uh, my dad actually has a long story that I can later get into. But point is, he came from Mexico, started working as a dishwasher, slowly worked his way up to a manager. Then from there, he um, became the owner of the restaurants we have now. And um, one of the clients he had was a, a movie producer from Santa Barbara. And right now, the film festival is happening. So uh, my mom, my dad, my boyfriend and I are attending. And yeah, we're at... But I'm waiting for my boyfriend right now. He's gonna come pick me up and then we're gonna go have dinner with my parents and it's actually his first time meeting them. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm sure it will be fine. My parents are cool, he's cool, so yeah. Um, but yeah. So he's here. He came to pick me up. I told them that you're meeting my parents for the first time. So. Hey. Are you nervous? <laughs> Um, I told them that. It was fine. You were cool. No, my friends are cool. It's gonna be good. Yeah. And then we're gonna go see my dad's film. Um, we're gonna have some bomb Mexican food. Yeah, we're going to El Cal... What's it called? El <laughs> Carlitos. I can't even say it in Spanish. Um, Carlitos, right? Carlitos. It looks good, yeah. Carlitos Cafe. I looked at the Yelp, which is really good. Yeah. I'll show you what we get in I'm a starving bit. too, by the way, so. He's gonna go ham. We're on a diet, so who knows? <laughs> might have to break it. Mm, I don't know, we'll see. Okay, catch you later. Um, this is his plate. What is this? It's uh, chicken and a honey. Or something. Uh -huh. Uh, this one's mine. Coconut shrimp. Yum. And then we broke the diet. <laughs> we got a gram And then we got uh, a latte. A latte. Your swagger is famous. <laughs> So we are here. It's pretty cool. It's pretty packed. Pretty cool. So we got to walk a little red carpet. Very important person, right? Yeah. <laughs> kind of weird, but it's fun. Hold on, hold on, I gotta show you guys something. Look at him. <laughs> hey. <laughs> trying to speak but someone over there <laughs> Gabby is making me a smoothie okay all better <laughs> but yeah so it's actually the next day and we watched my dad's film and it was the cutest thing ever um, we used to have another restaurant called East Beach Grill, but now it's no longer ours. Um, I'll explain later. But, um, I went home after that and then, um, packed a bag because I was gonna come, I was gonna work, which I already did. I worked 6 in the morning. I got off at 12 and then I drove all the way over here to LA to see my amiga. Yay. Gabs. Say hi, Gabs. What's up, people? <laughs> Yeah, so um, I just got here. I did my makeup, um, changed, having a tea because I'm on my period. <laughs> She's in pain. I'm in pain. I literally took like an Advil and two of what are they called, Gabs? Um, Pamperin. Pamperin. This is my first time trying those, and I took two. Wasn't doing anything. I took an Advil, and I feel like it's finally kicking in, and then also the tea is working. And she's making me a smoothie, protein smoothie, and then we're gonna just 
go downtown LA and see what we end up doing. So this is my smoothie that Gabby made me. What did you put in it, Gabby? Um, I put almond milk. Okay. Um, original, unsweetened. Okay. And then I put... So thick. I think it's this protein powder that's bomb. It's MRM. It's, I got it from yeah, Sprout, so but I'm pretty sure you can get it in other places. Oh, uh, nice. Plant-based because I have read really bad reviews about whey protein. Uh -huh. So I switched over to plant-based. And then what else? Oh, and then banana, frozen mm. banana, kale, mm. and um, berries. Yum. You guys should definitely try making this. It's so bomb. We're about to get some. Mangonelas! And it's called the Huino Raspados Nayari. Oh my goodness. Oh my god! So this is what I got. I got a guava. Raspado and she got some Los Locos and we're gonna share Bomb guys Guayaba, the bubble. Oh my god. Me it's too, like, that's how I was. Like it obviously tastes like guava, but then it has condensed milk, right? Yeah. Oh I don't know, god. the flavor is just delicious. It's so hot. You can tell that we did not like it at all. No, it was pretty horrible. It was horrible. Horrible. <laughs> no, I want more. So, we came to the mall because someone didn't dress warm. Me. Someone forgot to wear pants. <laughs> Me. I, I, I'm like, oh, because I live in Santa Barbara, Royal Carpinteria, and I always think it's gonna be hotter when I come to LA, but today is a little, it's a little but colder. But she forgets that during the night, it still gets kind of cold. Yeah, so I'm gonna go buy some pants. So we are going to get some boba before we get ramen. I like to get the... I don't see it. It's like a coconut. Co Cocomi mango, I think it's called. Really yummy. Hmm? So we're gonna have dinner and this is what she's gonna have before. <laughs> Would you like a sour? Um. So, this is my favorite drink. It's called Coco Me Mango, and I like to get um, boba in it with little pieces of mango gummy. And then Gabby over here. I don't want to talk about it. How do you like your chips? <laughs> it's so gross. What do they taste like? What are they, by the way? They're like shrimp chips. And I've always seen people eating them, so I've always wanted to try them, and I didn't want boba, so I was like, let me try them. They literally smell like fish food. Yeah, like I wish you guys could smell it. If, don't get them. If, unless you want fish food, then yeah, go wild. I, like I might as well get like the, the fish food and then just like snack on that. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least my drink is bomb. <laughs> All I gotta say is this better be bomb ramen. It is. Because <laughs> we're waiting outside and it's actually pretty cold. And she's wearing shorts. You know what? She has no one to talk because what did we just go through? I'm wearing jeans. <laughs> Holy jeans. But yeah. This is mine. I got the spicy miso ramen. The same as Gab's. She's waiting for hers. This is hers. Uh, <laughs> no, hers is coming. Um, 
Oh yeah. So we just got done eating and we are gonna go get a massage. It's gonna be $20 for an hour. So we're gonna relax and uh, yeah. And then from there I'll probably head home. Hopefully I'm not too relaxed because then. That's why I'm worried. <laughs> yeah, but I should be fine. I'll call Joe. He'll keep me distracted. Or awake. Mazian. But yeah, um, we're gonna go home. Well, we're gonna go to her place, um, take up our makeup and get comfortable so they can like, well, I wanna put on my shorts on again. So they like massage my legs with oil and all that. And then um, they massage your face. So I'm just gonna take off her makeup because yeah. So I'll show you guys the place where we end up going right now in a, a little bit. We're here. It's a super relaxed. And they charge 20 for an hour, so I'm so excited. See? One hour. 20. So, how'd you like it? It was really, really good. I was surprised because I, I was like, for $20, it's probably going to be really bad. Like, you're not going to, they're not going to, like, go hard. But yeah, it was so good. Yeah. When I, I, I was telling her when I got up immediately, like, I feel so light. Yeah. That's how I feel, and I still have an hour to drive home, but I feel really good. Like, just play music, yeah, and you'll be fine. Yeah, so definitely recommend this spot. Um, it's cheap, and then they really massage everything, so you'll be feeling good after. Yeah, but yeah, guys, so I am gonna go home, and this is the last thing I'm gonna film. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.